Hey everybody, Amalia with Karmic Kindness with your Wonder Wednesday post for today. Coming in at the last second, recording and posting a little bit late today. I almost didn't send uh, a mess or post a message today. Um, I don't know about the rest of you, but this energy right now is super intense and there's there's um, a lot of emotion swirling around and wreaking a little bit of havoc on my life, I have to admit. <laughs> and um, finding a, a place that feels like stable ground can be challenging these days. How are you feeling? I'm wondering about you. I'm wondering what's showing up for you in your world. Uh, I, what I've been hearing from folks, um, They've been having some physical uh, issues and conditions that are, that are uh, some are new and some are old that are returning. Uh, I'm also noticing a number of people with financial, some financial karmic clearing or financial karmic wounds that are coming to be cleared. So are you noticing any physical conditions, any sort of financial stuff that's coming up? And I mean, you know, for most of us, we have an ache and pain or pain here or there. Um, there might be some like, okay, I got to be careful with this or that when it comes to money. But these are these are things that are that are really highlighted for you. It, they're they're things that when I say it, you know immediately what they are. Um, and the third uh, relates to self value and self worth. Have have any things experiences, people, situations come up for you recently where you are questioning or are being put in a position where you feel this sense of, and it may not even be conscious because what I've noticed for me, this has come up for me recently, and that is I'm not even aware of it happening. It's just this feeling that I get where I all of a sudden feel like Oh my gosh, who am I to do that? Or how could I possibly do that? Or why is this happening and that happening? Because that makes no sense. Because for me, what? Huh? And it's this, it's this almost resisting gifts that are being given to you. So imagine you bought a gift for someone and you're so excited and you hand them the gift and they're like, no, I don't want it. I feel like that's been happening to me. These gifts are being handed and I somehow on some deep level don't feel I'm worthy of them or that I'm valuable enough to receive them. And it's this it's not even a conscious thing because I'm very well aware of my own value and worth, but somehow in some way and it's very sneaky and tricky, some of these old beliefs and these old habits and patterns and, and ways of thinking and engaging with life will creep in. So I, on this Wonder Wednesday, just wonder if any of these areas have shown up for you when it comes to your physical body and health, financial health, uh, and your sense of self-worth. How have they shown up for you where it's maybe clearing something out of the way or recognizing that you are worthy and valuable enough to be healthy, to be wealthy, and to be worthy on all levels. Remember, we learn from one another, so please do share with someone that you think may benefit from this message. And uh, also wanted to remind you that I have a um, cosmic chat coming up with Madeline Parker on this Sunday on my uh, Karmic Kindness YouTube channel at 3 p.m. Eastern. And I also recorded today with Stefan Dragon and a special surprise guest uh, who we talked today about um, relationships with Divine Masculine. Last week was a Divine Feminine. I'm going to drop a link for both of those below so that you can join the live on this Sunday for the Cosmic Chat, talking about the full moon in Sagittarius. And you can ch catch the replay of the We're In This Together that I recorded with Stefan Dragon, the dot silent leader. All right. Ciao for now.